Oh my god, it's Alex Clark! It's Friday, July 23rd, and the biggest news is that I'm kicking ass. Two inch street shows in Boulder, Colorado. If you're around, come and check them out. Well worth the drive. <laughs> Some big news in celebrity gossip is that Osama bin Laden's son, yeah, he is a celebrity. His name's Omar, and he just told press that he has an enormous crush on Drew Barrymore. Press say they don't see it working out, but I say it's a match made by Allah. Watching Alex Clark. Bin Laden and Drew sitting in a tree. K I S S I N T. First comes love, then comes marriage, then comes. <laughs> I know this would never happen, but you know it would make one hell of an awesome Hollywood romantic comedy. Every country has its sweetheart, and we all hope she finds her prince. Coming this fall, America's number one romantic comedy, Romeo Must Die, because he's a terrorist. Now this next story is just awesome. This 17-year-old kid, 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 I keep wanting to say kid, it's kid. I kid, I kid, kid. The 17-year-old kid named Steven Ortiz Ortiz. Now I'm getting it the other way around. The 17 year old kid named Steven Ortiz just got himself a 2000 Porsche Boxster sports car. I shit you not. How'd he do it? He's a hustler, baby. That's all you need. I'm a hustler, baby. On the Craigslist. Zip tie. <laughs> How did he hustle? Well, he started with a cell phone, and not even a good one. And then on Craigslist, and over the course of two years, traded the cell phone for an iPod Touch, to a dirt bike, to another dirt bike, then a couple other cars, until finally, two years later, he has himself a Porsche Boxster. I am just completely envious of this guy! But it gave me a great idea. I'm gonna try something similar. I don't know what I want to start with. Maybe you guys can leave in the comments what you think I should start with. But I want to keep trading up until $80,000 so I can sell it and then pay off my school loans. So you guys pick what you want me to start with and then we'll hustle around a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Now, that story may have blown your mind, but it did not prepare you for a story like this. That's because the city of Boulder, Colorado had to institute a new set of rules about attendance at their meeting. Let's kick it to Phil in the Field, who has more on this story. Bing! Oh, thanks, Alex! Phil in the Field here with more on the city of Boulder, Colorado, which is where I'm live from. It seems the council has taken a progressive stance on its future council meetings. After one enraged citizen showed up to a meeting naked, it has been unanimously decided that all council members are required to wear nothing more than their birthday suits. Apparently, they are a fan of nudity. Oh, oh. This is in, it's actually a ban on nudity, not a fan. I've got to run, Alex. Back to you. So that's your news for today. I just wanted to address one comment I got in my last video, which was from Jeff Number One Fan 9 I'm not Jeff, but I'll answer your question anyways. His question is, Welcome back, man. What would you do if you're recording on the streets and like a family walks past you and started looking at you, lol, what would you do? i take off my pants and go like this. Look at me! I'm naked! Let's rot! Keep staring! It gets bigger the longer you watch! I don't know if that's appropriate, but I would do that. Your quiz quickie for today is, do you think I should give this trading thing a try? I'm leaving it totally up to you guys. If you think I do it, I'll go full steam ahead, get my nose dirty in the Craig's list, as they say. Be sure to check out the website, it's alexclark.com. Leave comments, rate, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. This is It's Alex Clark, and I am going to go do some more shows. Peace out, Web Scouts. <laughs> I'm taking off my...